Hello everyone, and welcome to the light box. Here we have a um, commission I've been working on. These are Vikings from Footsore Miniatures. It's the first time I've painted, well, Vikings as part of a commission, but also any models from Footsore. And it was a very good experience all round. Bit of fun, really enjoyed painting those shields. Um, and yeah, that was good. client asked for the shields to be um, blue and white and um, I could pick my own patterns so I think I went with four in total, four different patterns. I've just put them onto some handles and, um, and you can see them at uh, different angles. There we go, that's a bit easier and we can uh, pick models out now and show a bit more detail. Let's get this guy, because uh, I really enjoyed painting that. Let's work this in. That's it, the fur. Just dry brushing, building up. Um, I think I start with like a black brown, uh, Vallejo black brown, and then car keys, and then sand colours, and even I think I like a little bit of white at the end or an off white. Um, but yeah, just dry brushing and then. Um, an Agrax Earth Shade wash after that. That's a bit better. I uh, just realised how uh, how dusty and grubby my uh, light box was, so I had to clean it. Here's the next batch. Very cool. I love the helmets. See this guy. Because I don't paint these uh, very often, I've taken a, a lot of inspiration from a friend of mine, another YouTube channel, uh, Jack Sarge. Many, I'm sure many of you guys watch his uh, watch his channel. Um, he does some really nice stuff there. You can learn a lot. Here. This dude. up without losing focus there we go I'm trying to make the shields um, really grubby as you can see I've gone for some tried to make the damage like that looks like sword and axe marks um, and then just a series of washes really to kind of give it that dirty look because I always think that it just looks too clean otherwise to be fair I could probably um, I could probably add another wash might do that. Some people uh, airbrush washes on. I could maybe give that a try. That's something to, uh, to try and do. This uh, guy at the back's got a sword. Yeah. That was it, really, guys. Just wanted to. Uh, thought I'd, I'd done something a bit different and. Uh, Thought I'd put it on the internet. I'll get some stills as well as I often do and I'll put them on as a slideshow as per usual and they'll also be on my Instagram. Uh, I've been asked quite a bit about the, the carry on on with tutorials and doing some more of them. We've done a flesh tutorial. I'd like to do um, I'd like to do more but the issue I'm having at the minute is uh, getting the camera right so if anyone's got any tips on what they use when they're um, what they're when they're painting is um, yeah. I just want to get that right because it's always so wobbly, or I miss the angle and lose focus. It's I'm finding that quite challenging. Otherwise, we'd have uh, had a few up by now. Um, but once I figure that out, we'll we'll start um, start getting some more stuff out there. But anyway, I hope you've enjoyed uh, enjoyed these uh, Vikings, and I will. See you for the next video. All right, take care. Bye.